Hey the friends, I'm craving burgers and fries. So I'm gonna share the healthy turkey burgers and sweet potato fries meal prep that I'm making this week that helped me lose 130 pounds and keep it off for eight years because you gotta give yourself what you're craving. That's how you love it and stick to it. So this is what we're gonna need. We're gonna make the burgers first. We're gonna need some lean ground turkey. I've got two pounds of extra lean ground turkey. I got these from Walmart. We're also gonna need some low-cal hamburger buns. These are 120 calories a bun, and they're the GV kind. Some light cheese slices, and these are the GV light ones. Baby dill pickles, we'll need six of them. Great value brand. Two. Pot potato, two potatoes, <laughs> two tomatoes. We also need some shredded iceberg lettuce. We like to buy this one from Walmart because it's already done for you, you don't have to do any work. Then we'll need some Calorie Wise or light mayo. I'm using Calorie Wise Miracle Whip. And then of course we'll need sweet potatoes but we'll show you the fry part after. Let's get the burgers going. I've got a piece of parchment paper here and I'm going to weigh out. I want to make six burgers, three for me and three for Sassy for the week. So I'm just gonna cut this open and start weighing out my burgers. I wanna make four ounce patties so that when they cook up, they'll be about three ounces cooked. Oh, that was so close. Imagine you guessed it right on. It was all oh, so close. It was 4.5. Like, Come on, honey. Yes. All right, we got it. So there's one. I'm just gonna form them into patties, flatten it out a bit, and then I will salt and pepper them all once I have them all weighed out and pattied up. All right, I ended up getting seven four ounce patties ready to go. And I've got about two and a half ounces left. So you can make like a mini one if you have like a kid or something, or you wanna feed your dog or something, there's some leftover. Um, what I'm gonna do is I have my pan preheating, two pans preheating on medium heat. I've sprayed them well with cooking spray. I'm gonna salt and pepper the tops of these to taste. And I put a little indent with my thumb in the middle of the burgers just so that they don't like puff up huge. Um, but you know, that's just a fancy step. Da, 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 da. Do your little pepper till your heart's content. Da, 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 da. I got this big baking sheet, so I'm just gonna go like this to transport them over to my oven or my stovey like that so that I can use the cutting board underneath for the tomatoes. <laughs> Come on, honey, oh yeah. So we're gonna transfer these over and then we're gonna cook them for about four to five minutes aside. Um, now that I got a couple off, I'm making it easier by just cutting around the burgers on the parchment paper and it'll be a lot easier to put them in the pan. Hey. There we are. We're learning. Oh yeah. Come on, sweetheart. We're just swooping around, swooping around. Oh yeah. Okay, while the burgs are cooking, I'm gonna slice up my tomatoes and I'm gonna put them in this container so that I don't have to do any prep for the week. I can just literally pull my tomatoes from there when I'm ready to eat. So we'll slice these cuties up real sweet. All right, it's been five minutes. Let's give these a flip. Woo-ha! ha Woo-hoo! <laughs> All right, the burgs are done. We ended up doing six minutes aside, and we'll... <laughs> All right, the burgs are done. We ended up doing six minutes a side and we salt and peppered the other side when we flipped it. And I've got the tomatoes sliced and ready to go. I've got four big sweet potatoes, medium to large, and I'm ready. I've got a big bowl of cold water to make the sweet potato fries. 
There, I'm using smoked paprika. I've got two teaspoons of that, half a teaspoon of ground black pepper, one teaspoon of salt, and I'm gonna be using a, tea, a tablespoon of canola oil. So I'm gonna slice these up into fry shapes and put them in the cold water to get some of the starch off. So just like, I've already rinsed them and chopped off like the bits that are not cute. There he is. Okay. Whacker. Like so. That looks beautiful. Something like this. Do you want long fries or short fries? Short. <laughs> beautiful. And the friends, meal prep was one of the most important things for me losing weight and being successful on my journey because if I was really hungry and I didn't have my meals prepped, I would end up eating things I didn't want to and overeating and then I'd go way off track. So having tasty meals prepped and ready to go is really important. And also, if I'm craving something like this week, burgers and fries, I try to prep a healthy or a low-cal version of it because if I don't love what I'm eating, I will not stick to it. So I really have to like it and who does not love burgers and fries? So, yeah, these are cute. Let's do that. So I'm just gonna chop all this up into little potatoes and then I will show you how I toss them and season them up. And when I'm finished this prep, I will show you guys like the cows and how I put the burgi together. All right, I have rinsed and drained the potatoes. Now what I'm going to do, they're all chopped up. I'm just gonna put them on a towel and dry them off to the best of my ability. And then I will Add in the spices. Oh wow, you get so many. Look how cute the myth. Oh, there we go. All right, and I'm just going to dry them up here. And we have the air fryer preheating to th at 390 degrees, and then um, we're gonna go about 20 minutes, but check them halfway through. Okay. Give them a good massage. Yep, give them a little sweet dry off. Dry them a bit you can here. All right, I ended up need, needing a bigger bowl here, so let's do that. And now I'm going to pour my tablespoon of canola oil over the potatoes, like so. I'm gonna put all of the seasonings in, and then I'm just gonna use my hands to mix it up until it's really well combined. And then I'll cook them in batches in the air fryer. So just coat these up real sweet. Get it all in there. Oh, wow, that smoked paprika really smells great. Oh, amazing. Wow. And actually, like, you wouldn't think it, but a tablespoon of oil goes a long way. Okay, I have sprayed the basket really well with some oil spray, and I'm just going to put a single layer of the sweet potato fries in. Okay, that looks good. So I'm gonna do, like I said, 20 minutes, and I'm gonna check them halfway through at 10 minutes. The friends, while the fries are cooking, I gotta show you something. Huddled HTLT Subs just came out with some new products. The first one is G Coffee Creamer. It's mocha latte flavor. It's got three and a half grams of protein and new tropics, which helps with mental clarity, focus, and memory. They also just came out with Collagen Plus. They have two flavors. This is the chocolate milkshake. They also have a homemade vanilla. It's 20 grams of protein and collagen in one scoopy. I was taking it separate. And you guys always ask like, how do I get healthy skin and hair? It's because I take collagen. Now I get it two in one. Code Nicole will save you 10% for all of it. The link is down below. Also, if you love low-cal, tasty recipes, you gotta check out my guilt-free cookbook. It's low-cal versions of all your favorite foods. You know what I got in there? Low-cal Big Mac, pizza, cheesecake, protein ice cream, so many beautiful stuff in there. Code Nicole will save you 10%. The link is down below. Okay, cuties, 
The fries took 12 minutes. I shook them around after 10 minutes and cooked them for another two. I'm gonna divide the fries into six servings. And again, I'm making three burgers and fry meals for me and three burgers and fry meals for Kyle. And I'm cooking the fries in batches. So this is what a batch looks like. It'll be three batches of two servings per um, batch. So half for me and half for Sassy. Okay, so I've got my bun. I'm going to take half a tablespoon of this Calorie Wise Miracle Whip and put it on the bottom of the bun, like so. There we are. Spread it around real cute, just like this. Okay, and now I'm gonna put some of the shredded lettuce. I'm gonna do about a quarter of a cup that and then put our I'm gonna put my sweet burger on top then I'm gonna do some one of those cheese slices there then some tomato And I'm going to salt and pepper the tomato. Sassy taught me to do that to add extra flavor. Hello, pepper. Spread it around. <laughs> and then some salt like that. And I'm going to do some pickles. Yeah. And then put the bun on the top and do a serving of fries. So this is half of that batch, right? Like so. Hey. That looks beautiful. Nice job. Thank you. And I'm gonna be dipping my fries in a tablespoon of this um, ketchup. It's the Heinz no sugar added ketchup in case you would like to do that as well. Wow, look at how beautiful that is. So this whole meal is 471 cals, 14 grams of fat, 67 grams of carbs, and 33 grams of protein. And I got a beautiful burger and fries to satisfy my craving for the week. All right, cuties, I hope you enjoyed this and that you know, we don't sell fear on this channel. What we hope is to inspire you to see that weight loss does not have to be a punishment. You're allowed to enjoy your food, make things easy, have your meals prepped and ready to go and things that you look forward to. You're allowed to love this. If you're not having fun, you're not getting it done. Meaning if you don't like what you're doing, you're not gonna stick to it. Watch this vid and this vid for more sustainable weight loss tips. Super fun and super realistic for real friends losing weight in the real world. Cause Sass and I love our food. Wake up every day and wanna just do it because we love life, love our food, enjoy the journey. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Peace, I'll catch you in the next vid. Cue the Rooney, I'm out. Yeah. Yeah. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up. <laughs>